Hello class! Welcome to my learning channel! To make this lesson interactive, follow these five steps. When you see this picture, a time for you to listen. When you see this picture, a time for you to read. Or a time for you to speak. When you see this picture, a time for you to answer. When you see this picture, a time for you to play. Let us learn new words today. It will help us to expand our vocabulary. So let's play when you know the answer. Tap your head. This is a clock. What do you see in the clock? How many hands does it have? Point at the R hand. Point at the second hand. Which move faster? What can you say about its chime? So, how many hands do the clock has? Three! Good job! What does the long and thin hand tell us? Fantastic! It's seconds! How about the other long hand? Minutes! Absolutely right! What about the short hand? Excellent! It tells R. Fast Forward by Leah N. Bautista Classes will start late tomorrow. Slick jump with joy. He said, I need not to hurry. I'll take it easy. I have lots of time to get things done. So he played with his friends in the yard. They talked and had fun until dinner time. Uh -oh. Slick's father said, Look at the clock's long minute hand. Fast forward it goes. It warns us that time flies by fast. So do first what has to be done while you have time to do it. He cleaned the grandfather's clock, which chimes ten times. Slick did not listen. Later, he had to move fast forward like the minute hand of the clock. He worked fast on his homework to get it done. He had to get up early and dress up fast, hoping he would not miss the school bus. But the bus was gone, so Slick skipped breakfast and walked fast forward to the school so he would not be late. Tired and hungry Slick said, The lesson I learned today is we need to move fast if we just manage our time well and do first thing first. That's the end of our story today. Let's see if you really understand the story. I have 10 questions for you. Who is the main character of the story? Why did Slick the grasshopper jump with joy? What did he do with his friends? What did he forget to do? What did father tell Slick to teach him a lesson? 
Why did this leak have to move fast? Did this leak sleep well? How did the minute hand move? How did this leak feel when he arrived home? What is the lesson of the story? See you in my next video. Bye-bye!